Hello, my dear friend. Let me ask you this question. Let's assume that you have the opportunity to be at the throne room of God, and God should ask you, What do you want? What would you say? Think about it. Would you ask for prosperity? Would you ask for long life? Would you ask for world peace? Would you ask for a husband or a wife? What would you say? You know, we have a lot of needs, a lot of issues that we are looking for answers and solutions. And so I know definitely if God should ask you to tell him what you want, you're probably going to have a lot of things to request or to ask for. But when Solomon was given the same opportunity, Solomon asked for something that to many of us wouldn't even make sense. Solomon had become the king of Israel. He needed money to be able to expand the kingdom. He needed money to be able to equip his army so that they would be strong to ward off enemies from coming to attack them. But Solomon didn't ask for any of these things. He didn't ask God to destroy all his enemies. He didn't ask God to make him a prosperous king. But Solomon asked God for one thing, and that is wisdom. He asked God to give him wisdom to be able to lead the people that he, God, has placed him in charge of. And listen, because of this, in 1 Kings chapter 3, verses 10-12, to 12, the Bible says, The speech pleased the Lord, that Solomon has asked this ten. Then the Lord said to him, Because you have asked this ten, and have not asked for long life for yourself, nor have asked riches for yourself, nor have asked life of your enemies, but have asked for yourself understanding to discern justice. Behold, I have done according to your words. See, I have given you a wise and understanding heart, so that there has not been anyone like you before, nor shall anyone like you arise after you. This is so amazing. Solomon asks for wisdom, the heart to be able to discern between what is good and what is right. My dear friend, when you have wisdom, success will be your only option. When you know how to descend between good and evil, God will bless you with prosperity. Solomon didn't ask for money, but he eventually had so much that he is still known to be the richest man ever to live on the face of this world. So dear friend, today God says, what do you want? Seek for wisdom, seek for understanding. In James chapter 1 verse 5, the Bible says, if, if anyone lacks wisdom, let him ask of God, who gives to all liberally. And without reproach and it will be given to him ask for what is right don't seek for temporal things ask for things that will last forever ask for wisdom and god will grant you the wisdom to be able to prosper in this life may god bless you may he make the way straight for you may he grant you wisdom from on high even as you decide to seek after his own wisdom in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.